Hello everyone, so once I get done talking, I'm going to let you all watch the video of the interview with this guy mother right here. So he is getting charged with killing his mother boyfriend and they interview his mother. And I didn't like something that she was saying, maybe just me, but let me know in the comment section what you all think about it. And don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and turn on the notification. Of 19 year old Antonio Hicks, charged with killing Air Force Sergeant Johnny Clyburn last Tuesday, is speaking out. She believes her son was simply jealous of the love she had for the decorated sergeant. Clyburn was engaged to Hicks' mother, and she calls her son a monster, wishing he could be sentenced to death for his heinous crime. 7 Action News reporter Kimberly Craig has the story. It's hard to imagine any mother wishing her own son could get the death penalty, but Nicolina Pace says not many mothers have seen what she has witnessed. To me, he's a monster. You were smart enough not to shoot yourself like that. You knew exactly what you were doing. Nicolina Pace is talking about her 19-year-old son, Antonio Hicks, who allegedly shot the man she was so eager to marry, her soulmate, Air Force Sergeant Johnny Clyburn. I think the devil was in Antonio, and I think he was jealous. I think he was jealous that... He had to leave because he knew he had to leave. We were planning a wedding. We didn't want you here. He knew he had to leave. And John was not going to take care of a grown man that couldn't even, that wasn't even trying to help himself. Nicolina says her fiance was her everything, their love like a fairy tale. And she says all John ever tried to do was help her son, who was never diagnosed with a mental condition. But she and John thought the 19 year old had some sort of problem. And John tried to help him get on Social Security. But Nicolina says her son never followed through. And he resented that he was going to have to move to Florida to live with his father. If he does have met schizophrenia, schizophrenia and mental illness. He gives those people a bad name. I don't even believe he has that. I just think he has the devil in him. The day after Memorial Day when Sergeant Clyburn got home from work, he was in the basement cleaning up something Antonio broke. Yeah, so John turned around to see what Antonio want. That's when Antonio shot him. Nicolina says she started hitting Antonio. He left the basement, but then came back. What do you think made him come back downstairs? Because I think he still thought John was alive. And Nicolina does not waver when she says she wishes her son could get the death penalty. Like a petition or something where he can get the death penalty and we can make an example out of him. And I would be the first person to put my signature at the top. I don't think he deserves to be here. He knew how in love we were. So why destroy it? It's like he think he, he walked away with some. Look what I took from you. He wanted to do this. I believe it was purposely done. I believe he thought about it. It was probably premeditated. And to anyone who has ever loved John, Nicolina says she is sorry for what her son has done. On Detroit's